Now, it's the age-old question, what is really out there? A new documentary called Australian Skies, you notice the spelling, it's a bit of a play on words, aims to uncover what thousands of unidentified flying objects seen above us really are and whether there's a government conspiracy to cover it up. My name is Don Mears. I'm on my way to spend four days with an Australian ufologist by the name of Damien Knott, who claims to have captured over 2,000 photographs and video of unidentified flying objects and paranormal phenomena. I am not a paranormal investigator, nor am I a ufologist. I am a documentary maker. I'm not after answers. I only believe in the experience. Yeah, it's a little bit spooky. The subject of the documentary, ufologist Damien Knott, joins us now, along with the film's director, Don Mears, who you heard there in that upshot. And good morning to you both. Damien, to you first, you've been seeing objects in the skies above Australia since you were nine years old. What exactly have you seen? Uh, okay, where do I start, really? Um, orange balls of light, white balls of light, red balls of light, all different craft of different size, shapes, you name it. It's, it's never-ending, really, all different types. And could it be that it has a simple explanation? Could these things be explained away as weather objects, weather, weather events or, or some you know, space objects? Well, in most cases, uh, you know, 90% of cases, they are explained away as, uh, you know, something quite normal. Uh, and benign, but there's the other five to ten percent of cases where uh, nobody can really give an explanation after a lot of investigation, and these are the cases that we're really concentrating on. Some people, I know that you've been in contact with a lot of others who have seen and experienced similar things to you, and some of those people believe that you've actually been abducted at some point because of the amount of experiences that you've had. How close have you gotten? Well, look, I've seen them up close, within a few metres, um, but I, I don't wish to comment and say that I've been abducted or anything like that. Um, that's not what we're concentrating on, and that's not what Australian Skies is about. Uh, it's about the story behind the people who are seeing the sightings, and also the fact that, uh, you know, the ufology gets a bad rap, unfortunately, and people who see these things, you know, uh, we're called this and that and, or, you know, crazy or whatever the case may be. But, you know, people see them and there's one scene around the world every six minutes or so and we just really want to know an answer. We're not saying they're aliens or extraterrestrial or anything like that. We just, we don't know what they are. And basically, this is what Australian Sky is about, to get this out there to show that the phenomena is happening to people and, um, and, and then people can take it from there and, and make up their own minds about it.